understand the point of the point of Sparkle is. Well, it's cool. Is it? I is it? We are cool now. And welcome to a very special edition of Mandate Mondays for the 4th of July. This week, we are going to be sampling the Jack Daniels Tennessee Whiskey. So the Jack Daniels Tennessee Whiskey, everyone should already know about. You cannot find a bar or a liquor store that does not carry this. Um, I've tried. You really have to be living under a rock if you haven't run into a Jack Daniels product. I mean, they make t-shirts, they make pretty much everything. I'm surprised they don't make baby clothes with these logos on it. The Jack Daniels Tennessee Whiskey is a 40% alcohol. It's 80% corn, 12% rye, and 8% malt uh, that make up this specific whiskey. This bottle was like, I think, 12 to 15 bucks. The 750 is actually around 35 bucks, which I kind of think is a little on the high side for the Jack Daniels. Yeah. Um, I remember my 22nd birthday, I got a pint of this and put it down in about 45 minutes, and then I didn't remember the rest of the night. I think I woke up in the Boston Commons. That's your body coming in and trying to make you forget the flavor of it. <laughs> I believe it was Greg that saved me from getting picked up in the drunk tank. So what makes this a Tennessee whiskey is it- it's Made in Tennessee. Outside of just being made in Tennessee, is it's actually filtered through uh, 10 feet of sugar maple charcoal, which gives you that uh, smokiness flavor to it, along with the smooth and sweetness that you get out of this. Charcoal mellowed. It's like marsh mellow, but charcoal mellow. It's like when you're getting at a campfire and you burn the marshmallow, that's that's what this is. Yep. In a bottle. According to the tasting notes, this is extremely sweet. There's there's a lot of sugars in here, uh, hence the corn. You'll also notice, like we said, a smoky taste to it, and also a very nutty taste, or oily nuts is what they say, which is kind of <laughs> funny <laughs> to read in there. And I do believe it was, what was it like? Uh, Banana nutmeg or something? Milkshake. Yeah, I think whoever wrote that was using someone else's mouth to taste this. Why don't we go ahead and pour this out? We aren't doing any ice, no stones. Give this a try. So right off the bat, it is a nice golden color. Straight in there. It smells actually, for 40% alcohol, it has a very strong alcohol smell to it. You know, like you'd expect in something that's at 46 or even 50% alcohol. Definitely, definitely very sweet. What do you say we give it a taste? Yeah. <laughs> very sharp for 40%. There's a distinctive oaky flavor to it. And you can definitely taste the charcoal, the smoke that they throw into it as well. Very sweet. Somewhat it's smooth. It, it's not smooth. It, uh, <laughs> it's actually a very dry aftertaste. So the Jack Daniels Tennessee whiskey, similar to other US whiskeys, are aged for about four years. So I mean, I don't know, I wouldn't exactly order this as a standalone drink, just straight or neat. I don't know about you. I wouldn't order it at all, but that's just me. I mean, you can order it with, I guess, any kind of soda. People do that. Is that a thing people do? When you get to the distillery, there's actually a couple different parts. Parts of it, as you can see, are part of the distillery and the manufacturing place, are on the industrial side. There's a couple of nice places that people can visit and some gift shops and whatnot. And there's that statue of Jack. I feel like he looks so much like Colonel Sanders. No. Not at all. Personally, if I was out in a bar, um, I wouldn't order this straight. I would be using this in something like a mixer, like a you know, whiskey and coke or whiskey and ginger. Um, but if I were to go with something straight, especially at the price point, you'd see me jumping into the, you know, Glenn Levitt's or Glenn Fittich's um, and uh, potentially McCallum's, depending on the pricing. If you're in a bar and, I mean, this is all they had, I would get a rum and coke. Thank you very much for joining us for this very special edition of Mandate Mondays for the 4th of July weekend, where we got the sample, the Jack Daniels Tennessee Whiskey. Yeah, we, we got the privilege of having this. It's, it is a privilege. So, God bless America, and have a fantastic and safe 4th of July weekend. I think that's good. Yeah. Do you think we did it okay? Do you want some more? No. <laughs>